हाई स्टूडेंट्स नॉर्मल रिएक्शन इज अ कंपोनेंट ऑफ कॉन्टेक्ट फोर्स परपेंडिकुलर टू कॉन्टेक्ट सरफेस इफ देयर इज एनी कॉन्टेक्ट सरफेस देन दिस नॉर्मल रिएक्शन विल बी परपेंडिकुलर टू इट सी दिस इज अ ब्लॉक which is kept on this horizontal surface here is i can say this red surface is the contact surface to which this body is in contact so if contact surface is this then normal reaction will act perpendicular to it if i talk about a block kept on a inclined plane then no doubt we can say this is the contact surface so normal reaction will act perpendicular to this inclined surface say for example this is an horizontal this is a horizontal surface a rod balances in this sense if i draw about this end i'm only observing the normal reaction on this end of rod then here i can say this is the contact surface obviously as we have taught here as i have mentioned here normal reaction is always perpendicular to contact surface so contact surface here is for this end is this horizontal surface so no doubt normal reaction at this end will act somewhere in this direction means perpendicular to the horizontal surface this is the normal reaction here in previous cases normal reaction here is perpendicular to incline and here again perpendicular to horizontal surface let us consider one more example i have taken a surface of the shape as english letter english mark english mark correct i have taken this example just to, just to show normal reaction at this contact only so we will later discuss about the normal reaction here but here we are taking this end only for our consideration no doubt here contact surface is this one as this is contact surface so normal reaction will act perpendicular to it always remember in mind that when contact surface can be drawn there we must take normal reaction perpendicular to it if there is no contact surface what is the meaning of if there is no contact surface means contact of body is with some edge or a point just consider two three examples if this condition occurs then normal reaction 
should be taken perpendicular to surface of body let us picturize me this thing i think then it will become more clear to you see there is a pyramid and at the top of this pyramid we have a plant which rests which rests over this pyramid in this way now you can see here that there is no contact surface though there is a contact point to which this wedge is in contact now we can see that here a plane of body can be drawn here so what will we do we will draw normal reaction perpendicular to this plane of body if we consider our previous example in which there was a stair and and a road was kept against this stair in this sense what will we do here we will try to draw normal reaction this time at this contact if this contact is taken you can say that there is no contact surface though there is a contact edge as we have discussed in past also what we will try here we will try here to draw the plane of the body which is obviously in this line now normal reaction must be perpendicular to it so i will draw normal reaction perpendicular to this rod for this contact here in this case one contact is with the contact surface as we had discussed earlier but if we see this side or this contact into consideration then this is the surface and this is its one edge and here edge of the body is in contact with edge of the surface so it is edge to edge contact and in this case anybody can be confused thinking of which surface is to consider as plane of body or which contact surface so what will we do here we will assume two separate components of normal reaction one along horizontal and name it just an x and the other component you can say 
एन वाई इन टू म्यूचुअली परपेंडिकुलर डायरेक्शन दिस कंसिडरेशन इज टेकन हियर टू सॉल्व प्रॉब्लम्स रिलेटेड विथ लॉज ऑफ मोशन और वर्क फॉर एनर्जी एंड टू अप्लाई द लॉज एंड टू गेट द डिजायर रिजल्ट we have to take these two components if we do not take these two components then our answer will be wrong that's why what i am explaining you here is applicable to get answers or to get solution of a particular problem where this type of forces are involved consider one more example in this example this is horizontal surface i have two rods if we have a particular situation where two rods are in contact with each other it ends only no doubt thinking of contact surface here is of no use because there is no particular surface here two points of the given two rods are in contact so this is point to point contact and this in this condition also what we must do we must take normal reaction into two mutually perpendicular directions the one component is vertically and other component along horizontal i am writing it here an x so how to draw normal reaction in these cases is the matter of very much importance because these are the initial steps to clarify and understand the situation if we are not able to draw correct set of forces then the condition in solving becomes more adherous so these are my suggestions to you that you must proceed in this way surely you will get result very quickly